Prolactose is an exclusive human milk diet um, because babies tolerate, human babies tolerate human milk so well. Um, we've been able to fortify uh, early, uh, much earlier than we used to with cow's milk protein. Um, somewhere around, um, depending upon the size of the baby, if they're littler, we um, push maybe back to 50 to 60 mLs per kilo per day. The larger babies around 40 mLs per kilo per day will begin early fortification uh, with the uh, Prolac Plus 6 product, and uh, we've seen it tolerated very well. The um, feeding protocol, we've incorporated that into our, our protocol, so um, it's led to um, improved growth, especially as we're trying to come off of TPN and get a central line out earlier. Maximizing the antral nutrition uh, has been key to growth. Our focus on the use of mom's own milk and donor milk um, instead of using cow's milk formula mm -hmm. um, is actually made such a big difference in or decreased the amount of nutritional emergencies that we have. Um, it allows us to, again, fortify a little bit earlier, um, as you said, and really get through to full feeds and be able to get babies to where they need to be to get them off of the central lines and work forward. Getting rid of the cow brain. Um, yeah. Worried about cow's milk protein when you're giving a human milk diet, um, we're just not seeing those complications happen like we used to see when we had to push formula. Well, and I would be curious, the, the guidelines recently changed for fresh milk. Um, I would be curious to see what kind of long-term outcomes there's going to be for being able to utilize more fresh milk um, instead of freezing mom's milk and then um, fortifying. And our mothers get a really great buy-in um, when we ask that for that fresh milk. They understand that importance um, to the baby and um, working with nursing to ensure that that fresh milk is handled appropriately, not put into the freezer mistakenly and so forth. So parents have really been, mothers especially, have been really driving the importance of fresh.